Um, we work hard. That's all there is to it. We work hard in the summer, work hard in the weight room, work hard at practice. That's all our team's about, just working hard every day in and out. Uh, the win against Northwood, what did you guys do well? What do you guys try to carry, a, carry over from that win you could apply this time against Mission Boyinger? Uh, playing vicious, playing mean, gang tackling, uh, running through hits, making big plays. As far as this uh, rematch goes, what did you take away from last year? Obviously, uh, didn't go the way that you guys yeah. wanted. So what do you take away from that that you can apply this time around? Um, well, we now know what it takes at that uh, type of level that for playing for a regional championship. We know the type of caliber of team we have to be to beat a team like Bishop Dwanger, who's been there multiple times. So it's just uh, going there and playing to set football. What's the focus in practice this week? What are you guys really focusing on? Being relentless. Uh, offensively, what is it about this team that's allowed you guys to kind of jive and work well together? Uh, you know, because last year you had to replace Roddy, you had to replace a number of key positions, but you guys have kind of picked up where you went left off, but it is a different cast of characters to a certain degree. Um, I think it's team chemistry because uh, Jerry Gibson, our quarterback, I've been playing with him since sixth grade. Like I grew up, he was my quarterback. Same with Chase Neff and um, Antonio. Like we just all blend well together. I think that's how it is. Final question in your eyes, what's going to be the biggest key on Friday night? Big plays, making big plays uh, every quarter, every uh, down, just making big plays. Uh, we really bonded together and played together, and that really helped us overcome everything. What did you learn last year heading into this season? You had to replace some key players, but you're at the same point undefeated, uh, just with a, kind of a different cast of characters. How, how, did you, uh, how did you learn from last season to apply to this year? Uh, we learned like what it takes to get to where we are and what we need to do to get back here. What do you tell, tell me about this defense? Uh, because last year you guys were kind of a, an offensive team. This, this year people are talking about the team. What's allowed the defense as a whole to be special? Uh, really like our togetherness and our willing to do what it takes to accomplish what we need to. In practice this week, what's, what's the big focus? What are you keen on as you get ready for the players? Uh, we're keen on like being physical and not like thinking of last year and not letting that get to us and just playing our game. Yeah, what do you take away from last year? Because obviously, you know, the game was here, 34 to zero, it wasn't the outcome that you wanted. What do you take from that you can apply this time? Uh, it shows that like we can't afford to make mistakes and we need to learn from our mistakes last year and make sure we don't do those again this Friday. Final question, what are you most looking forward to about this Friday's game? Uh, just the atmosphere, the fans, the noise, just everything. The game of football is going to be great. Team, you guys playing your best football, just knocked off the number one team in the state. What is it that's allowed this team to play its best football at the right time? Yeah, we, we've practiced with great energy, practiced hard, practiced with a purpose, and competed all year. Uh, it's, it's no secret that we played well on Fridays because we practiced well, and, and our kids have bought into the belief that you have to practice and, and practice well and take it one day at a time to be successful. And, and uh, just watching our scout team uh, run down the field on kickoff last night and just getting after it wide open, is playing as hard as they can. Uh, uh, I, I, we've practiced well again this week, and, and I'm confident it's going to translate into playing well on Friday. I think last year people looked at it and said this is an offensive team that also plays well on defense. Offense was the focal point. Yeah. This year it feels like the opposite. How have you guys been able to have so much success defensively, especially knowing that you know you had some players to replace, but you guys have picked up where you've left off and kind of added to it on the defensive side? Yeah, team? I mean, we had eight, eight, nine guys back that played a lot of football on defense last year, so uh, we knew we'd have a good defensive unit. and. Uh, our kids have done a little bit better each year, and, and they have again this year in studying tendencies, studying film, uh, being all over scout and report. Coach, coaches send out quizzes. Our defensive guys do a great job, and our guys really take it serious as far as preparing and, and uh, working on the mental side of the game as well as the physical side. Well, last year was 34-0 to zero at your place against Wenger. What do you take away? What does this team take away from that experience to make it you know, obviously a closer game? This time yeah, around. sure. Well, th they had an edge last year that we didn't have, and uh, I think the game was a little closer than the score indicated. It, it, and, and they handled us at the end. They were the better, better team, no question about it. Uh, but but uh, we had a chance to score in our first series. We had a field goal blocked uh, right down there, close to a touchdown. We gave up a score on a, on a third and 24, third and goal on the 24. Uh, and, and what we've taken from that is we've got to make those plays. We have to play with an edge. We have to make plays all the way around. Final question for me. What is going to be like the key factor? What's going to be the most important thing on Friday night for this? But, yeah, we, we just have to play with an edge. We have to contest every play. We have to give them nothing. They have to earn everything.